Hi everyone, I'm Marie Yeager from CRP Automotive, and on this episode of Inside the Brands, we're going to take a look at a growing trend in the motor oil market. Hello again. Today I'm going to talk about motor oil, specifically low viscosity motor oil. For decades, the viscosity for multi-grade motor oils tended to be something like 10W40 or 5W30. But in recent years, synthetic low viscosity oils like this 0W20 have become more commonplace. And there's a good reason for that. The government CAFE standards established in 2012 stipulate that manufacturers must meet a 54.5 miles per gallon target average fuel economy for all the vehicles they make by 2025. In general, low viscosity oils last longer and help engines run smoother, thus improving gas mileage by up to 5%. Additionally, to help hit the very ambitious CAFE target, some car manufacturers are also turning to smaller engines, often relying on turbocharging to help these little engines make sufficient power. These smaller turbocharged engines run extremely hot requiring advanced formulations of motor oils to protect the engine parts from overheating and wearing out prematurely. So the current and future motor oil formulations will pretty much all be low viscosity with highly technical wear protection additives. Penison has offered OE approved synthetic motor oil for European vehicles for quite a few years and have recently expanded into low viscosity oils with the strict OE specific formulations that include the high technical wear inhibitors. Look for new Penison 0W20 OE specific formulations for BMW, Jaguar, Land Rover, Volkswagen, and Volvo coming to the North American market in 2018. That about wraps it up for now. If you have a question about low viscosity oil or Penison fluid in general, feel free to post it below or on the CRP Automotive Facebook page. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to be among the first to learn about new oils like this one. Thank you for watching. Thank you.